Hey everyone, uh, welcome to this Energy Clearing Live. I am doing a really inspired energy clearing today and I'm really excited about it because I feel like it's going to benefit so many people. It definitely will. And this is a very interesting topic that came up the other day with one of my clients and then I just felt, okay, a lot more people need to have like the support with this and receive energy clearing around this because yeah, it's pretty common. So what I want to talk about today is, well, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to provide you with energy clearing. We're going to release um, subconscious limiting beliefs, old patterns, ideas, and we're going to bring in downloads and energy clearance to help you move on or let go of relationships, friendships, or connections with people in your life that you feel like are maybe not the healthiest now. Um, maybe you feel like they're just not aligned with you anymore. Maybe you've like been connected with these people for a really, really long time and you would like to let go, but you just feel like you can't. Um, so this is an energy clearing to help you actually let go of connections and friendships that are no longer working for you, that are not aligned for you, okay? Um, so it's going to be very powerful. It's going to play a lot of change for a lot of people. So if you are watching live or you're going to watch the replay, just leave me a comment. Um, just even say hey or let me know how it was for you. And also please, please share this with anyone that you feel will benefit from it as well because it's going to be epic. Okay, so first things first, in order to receive any of the clearance or the downloads or to change anything, all you have to do is listen to what I'm going to offer and then all you have to do is just say yes in order to receive it and it will just create the change for you like that. Simple. Um, so I'm going to be using the uh, theta healing and um, the theta healing technique to do that. Um, I'm not going to go into all the details about theta healing. I'm just going to tell you that that's the technique that I'm using. All you have to do if you want to receive the change connected with this is just say yes and you'll receive it and you'll feel it. Okay. So first of all, I want to start with the idea of friendship. Okay. So. Anywhere you have like a definition of friendship, whatever your definition of friendship is that you may have based on your experiences in life, that actually may not be the, you know, the highest and the best definition of what real friendship is. Maybe you have a definition of what friendship is in your mind, in your subconscious, that's maybe unhealthy, you know, that's not like, yeah, it's not the healthiest um definition hey nicola so would you like to basically would you like to clear release and let go of any definitions of what friendship is that you have that are not healthy and are not the highest and best and also can we bring in so let's download for you it or instill like the truest definition of what friendship is like the highest and best definition of what real friendship is and can we download that into your subconscious and into your energy so that you know what that is so that your definition now moving forward can line up with that okay so if you'd like that just simply say yes okay and one of the biggest things that comes up around this topic is for a lot of people from nearly everybody is that what a lot of us can do and i've done this before as well and what people can do is that they base the value of a friendship and the quality of a friendship they base it on the length of time that the friendship has been in place for example, if someone's like if someone's talking about someone in the life that they have a particular friendship with and maybe they're thinking about like, you know, like maybe just letting go of this person. If there's resistance, they might say things like, oh, yeah, but we've been friends since we were kids. Oh, yeah, but we've been friends for this amount of time. And why people are saying that is because there's this conditioning that we receive. It's like the length of time you have a friendship for equates to the value of it which is not true because you can be friends with someone for your whole life and it can be an unhealthy toxic friendship that doesn't even support you so 
anywhere you're actually having or holding on to friendships that are like that, that are unhealthy for you or not good for you, toxic for you, unsupportive for you, and you're not seeing that, would you like to be able to release whatever's not um, allowing you to see the truth in it? Can we bring in the truth um, around all of these friendships for you so that you can see them clearly, like with a clear vision? Yes? So if you'd like that, just say yes. But also, can we release this idea every like that like the length of a friendship equates to the value of it? Can we release everywhere you associate the value with the length of time? And can we show you the truth about that? And can we show you that you can have a friendship that's just brand new and it can probably be the healthiest one that you've ever had? Like so, can we show you what's what's true about that and what's possible? Yes. Okay, so there's a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot release on this. So this is very good. Okay, so I have a lot of notes here with this because I wanted to get a lot done with this. Right, and then also, when we have friendships that are like, that we've had for a significant amount of time, like as well, what you can kind of do is, you know, like if it's someone that you claim to be like your best friend or, you know, like you're really close to them, you can kind of make unconscious or sometimes conscious, like, promises or commitments to them you know promise to like never to never not be friends a promise to never break break up or separate you know and you can make all of these like conscious or unconscious commitments vows promises and agreements that actually keep you like energetically bind together even when like it comes to the point where it's not working for either person anymore so anywhere that is happening right would you like to just clear release and let go of any kind of these unspoken agreements contracts that you might have with these people and um, vows promises to like to stick together forever would you like to release all of them and can we show you that it's safe to now let go of them yes Okay, and then anywhere, anywhere you have these, any ideas that like, for example, if you, when you're watching this, if you're thinking of like maybe a specific person or maybe a group of like a number of different people, you might have ideas or beliefs subconsciously or consciously that like, you actually can't be without them. Like maybe one day, a very long time ago, you decided that, oh, I can't live without this person. And you actually made that solid and made it a belief. So anywhere you're actually, you believe that you actually can't live without these people. Can we just release that idea and can we teach you all what it feels like to move on, to live your life, to be happy and to completely thrive in life without this particular person or these people, whoever they are. Would you like to know what that feels like? And can we bring in the belief that it's also possible for you? So if you like that, just simply say yes. Okay. And anywhere you believe, like, anywhere you're carrying ideas that like, oh, well, anywhere you decided in the past that you owe them for whatever you've decided you owe them, like whatever you owe them for, maybe they've done something really good for you or they were there for you a lot or supported you a lot in the past. And subconsciously now you're in, you're indebted to them and you feel like you owe them. So if you carry this belief that, oh, well, I owe them, I owe them for this and I owe them for that. Then if you are desiring to move on from somebody and like let go of a friendship or a connection, this will keep you stuck if you feel like you owe them. So would you like to just release this idea that you do owe them? Yes. And can we just like clear any of the like energetic debt that you have like connected with them? Yes. And can we show you the truth around that? Yes. So if you'd like that, just say yes. But also, anywhere you are energetically, anywhere your energy or your beliefs, like, is all, like, enmeshed with theirs, with, with these other people. Like, anywhere your energy is all entangled up in each other's, or anywhere your beliefs are all, like, stuck together and you're kind of, like, living the same kind of reality. Can we just 
untangle all of that and can we show you how to actually live separate from like people in your life how to live separate from people that you're close to how to live separately energetically that that's okay and that it's safe and that you know how to do that can we bring that in for you what that feels like as well yes okay and then anywhere you associate because there's a lot of friendships that you can have that can feel quite unhealthy and like almost like a little bit toxic and that's when there's like there's like this energy of competition involved so anywhere any of you are holding on anywhere any of you are experiencing that like competition and friendship can we shout can we release anywhere you associate friendship with competition and would you like to know that it's possible to have friendship without competition would you like to know what that feels like and would you also like to know that you can have friendships that are supportive where the where the other person genuinely supports you genuinely is rooting for you and is genuinely happy for you can we bring in the truth of that and teach you what that feels like to have and hold friendships of this quality. Yes. Okay. And what else? Would you like to know through your intuition? Okay. How to distinguish, how to differentiate between um, friendships or connections or people that are genuine or ones that are like non-aligned, like not aligned for you and not for your highest, the best. Would you like to be able to clearly distinguish the difference between the two, that you can do that with ease? Would you like to know what that feels like to be able to do that? And can we have the divine source energy like show you how to actually do that and that it can be easy yes can we release all the fear of being judged as a bad person judged as selfish like for doing this can we show you the truth around that that it's actually not selfish yes But also, would you like to know what it feels like to, for these types of connections and relationships and friendships, like, that it can just be a gradual thing that happens, like, over time, like, with both parties just, like, kind of, you know, like, kind of understanding like the energy and understanding that it's changing and just allowing it to happen with ease but without needing to like really without needing to talk about it without needing for it to be a drama that it can just happen that people can just come away and you could just separate like almost like naturally in a way that feels just like like a natural progression and it can be like that can we show you that it can be like that and can we teach you what it feels like for it to happen like that Yes, we is. Okay. Okay, so how's that? And then also, just to finish, can we just bring in, let's just bring in a clearing. Let's just bring in a healing for all of the, like, relationships in your life. Let's just bring in whatever energy is required for everybody to take the next step and can we also teach you what it feels like to easily and gracefully let go of people connections relationships that are no longer aligned with you can we teach you what it feels like to actually let go of them with ease that you can just do it and it can feel easy like no drama no stress and can we teach you what it feels like to do it with grace and with confidence yes And can we show you that when you let go of like these connections and people that are not aligned with you anymore, that so much more will show up in its place. So can we bring in the truth of that? But can we also teach about what it feels like to just be surrounded by 
connections, people and friendships that are completely aligned with you, who you are and where you're going next. And can we show you that that's possible? Yes? And can we teach you all what it feels like to be in the energy that just receives this, that just calls in these people? Yes? <sighs> okay. Yes, yes. Nicola says, yes, 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 please, yes. So, let me know how that is. I mean, that's all I've got coming through. I don't have anything else coming through right now, but I feel like that was like a juicy amount. Um, obviously, if any of this clearing has brought up like uncomfortable feelings or, you know, like brought up something for you that you feel like, oh, I have a lot of this going on, I need to change this, I need to work on this, you could need to work on it just on a deeper level and you might need to do a bit of deeper work. Um, so if that is something that you need, you can always reach out to me um, and we can talk about what like you might need and what kind of work you might need to do and we could actually maybe work together on actually helping you do that, okay? So all you need to do is reach out to me, send me a message and we can talk, it's that simple. Um, Nicola, you're so welcome. And hi, jo Jyoti. Um, so, as I said, please share this with anyone you feel may benefit from it. Leave me a comment. I love the comments. It boosts the it boosts the live the replay on the algorithm. So that's amazing. If you can leave as many comments as you can. <laughs> Needed to hear this. Thank you. You're so welcome, jo Jyoti. Um. I will, yeah, I will leave it at that, and everybody have an amazing day, okay? Ciao.